Hello world and welcome back to the weekend vlog. Today is Saturday and I'm about to go on an adventure per usual with my roommate and we're gonna go meet up with a friend of ours, a former roommate. We haven't seen her in a really long time so we're gonna go have some fun. Well, that's what's coming, stay tuned. As far as other life updates, yesterday was my last day at my job and it was a weird realization to know that I was leaving a situation or a place that I wasn't just entirely fed up with, which is typically my reasoning for leaving things but just knowing that there are better things on the horizon and that I just want to try something new so it was really crazy and surreal feeling and so sad to say goodbye to everyone but I was fucking partying like all week yeah so this weekend I'm gonna go have some fun with some friends and then it I don't I'm not even confined to the weekend so I don't know what I'm saying the plans are try to start prepping for Europe because that's literally next weekend holy shit and also finish moving so stay tuned for that yeah. <laughs> day now. Yesterday we went to Dave and Buster's as you saw. It was a good fucking time. And today, oh, <clears throat> I need to finish moving. The main things that are left are this big boy and that big boy and that big boy and that big boy. So I'm recruiting a friend today and renting a U-Haul, which I've never done. So that should be entertaining. And we're going to carry this down two flights of stairs and then up three flights of stairs. It's going to be so fun. <laughs> Here I am in my truck. This makes me want a truck real bad. I feel unstoppable. I feel large and in charge. I could run any of y'all off the road if I wanted. There it is. Going for the mattress. <laughs> Moving. We're done with the big rig, I'm going to return it. Now I just have to move all the rest of my little shit, but I think we're going to go return this and then go to lunch. And my friend is driving my car. What is he doing? Where's he going? Where are you going, friend? Am I going the wrong way? What's going on? He's just taking my car for a joyride. <laughs> Stop that. Stop with the <laughs> obscenity is I'm trying to get this cute video. At the pub. <laughs> Um, I don't know how to tell the difference. Is that a Frenchie? Mm. This stuff is a dink. That looks dank. It does. Hell yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. This is the last of it. Lived here for two years. All of quarantine for the most part. Worked from home many days in this bedroom. Did a lot of soul searching here. And it's coming to an end. This is crazy. <laughs> and I've packed everything up except for everything in the kitchen. So I guess I'm gonna come back tomorrow and do that. Today is Monday, and this is the first Monday in two and a half years that I have been unemployed. While I feel an amazing sense of freedom, I do also have a slight bit of panic setting in just because I have no more income. And right now I'm about to go run a bunch of errands and all of those cost money. So it's just a weird feeling. I'm trying to get back into my spirituality manifestation mindset of money is abundant to me and is free flowing. And if I spend money and invest in myself, that's only going to come back to me and greater. That was like not a sentence. It's only going to come back to me along with more funds to do more fun things. It's just scary. <laughs> so I'm about to go spend a bunch of money. Come with me. <laughs> okay, so I'm back from running all of my errands.
payments and now I owe you a room tour and a thrifting haul. <laughs> Here is the completed room. Oh my god. So cute. There's my dresser and my bed and my laundry and some miscellaneous shit that I don't want to unpack and then my closet. Wow, looks so good. I just got these like soft, they're kind of tie dye shorts for the summer. The next thing I got was these shorts that I knew were probably not gonna fit, but hear me out. What if I randomly get really in shape? Yeah, I can get them on, but like they don't look good, you know? Squeezed in there like a honey baked ham, but they're really cute. They have like the dazzle on the butt. <laughs> That's how tight they are. Um, anyways, I knew these weren't gonna fit, but I had to send it down. This next one's really disappointing. I think it's supposed to be like low rise. Maybe it will be a nice little tube top moment. This may be the worst thrifting I've ever done. I literally thought these were gonna be like mom jean, like baggy on me. This has really been the worst thrift haul I've ever done. These look good on my butt, I guess. And they're not comfy. Not what I wanted. <laughs> having a meltdown. Basically, I went thrifting because I wanted to do a baby thrift. In preparation to go to Europe, I'm planning on just wearing a lot of jeans there and I want to be comfortable. And my favorite pair of comfy jeans, I ripped a hole in them. So I just wanted some comfortable clothes and everything I bought was too small. <laughs> it's okay though, I can exchange them, I guess, but now I have to go back. Well, so that I stop just bitching on here because no one wants to hear that. My life is so great and privileged, so I should shut the fuck up. On that note, I am going to go now. Okay, bye.